So people tend to come to me. They want to know how tall I am, if I play basketball, where I play. Before we know it, we are in 10, 15 minutes deep in conversation. And once you connect with people, just everything else becomes a lot easier from that point on. I grew up in Senegal, West Africa. I'm the baby of eight siblings. The first year I played basketball, I almost quit because I had, I had no shoes. I played barefoot because the biggest size I could find was uh, size 11, and I was size 14. I had a neighbor, he was doing business in the US, and I told him I think I'm gonna quit. And he said, why? I said, because I had no shoes. And he said, I think we were the same size. Come by the house, I'll give you a pair. And he gave me this brand new white Nikes. It was unbelievable. For me, a poor kid, having a brand new white Nikes it was a big deal. Without those shoes, most likely I would have quit. That led into me meeting Greg Winston, former basketball player from San Diego, California. Greg saw some potential in me, and he's like, okay, let's do this. When I get back to the States, I'm gonna try to find your school. Came back to the US two weeks later, he called me and he said, hey, I found your school. Before you know it, I moved to San Diego. Within a few months, just playing basketball, the, the word spread out. I had all the West Coast schools, East Coast schools recruiting me all over the country. Honestly, no look pass into Mulai, who scored it, about a five footer. When I got to Kansas, having the privilege to play for two of the best college basketball courses in America, period. In the world, I should say. Now, one year for under Roy Williams and the remaining three years under Coach Bill Self. Both Hall of Fame coaches, you know, hundreds of wins, national championships, you name it. They have a belief system. Those men, their words mean something. Whatever they tell you, you can take it to the bank. And they have a process. They really have a really defined process and everything involved around the process, and which is very similar to what we do at Dimensional. We have a strong philosophy, a belief in the power of markets. We have an unbelievable process to give us the track record we have. After my junior year, my number one goal was to play in the NBA. But I was diagnosed with some degenerative disc in my back, and the doctor told me if I keep playing basketball, I may not be able to walk in 10 years. I have been working towards this dream for the past 15 plus years, and overnight that dream got shattered. But I always knew there's life after basketball. So I went back to KU and got my MBA. Throughout my life, every step of the way, I have had a coach. Not just a basketball coach, but a life coach in general. Sometimes when you talk about coach, people would just refer to athletics. But to me, coaching is beyond athletics. Because at one junction in your life, they help you really overcome some obstacles. And that's what the financial advisors do. The market is very volatile. And there's a lot of noise on a daily basis. Having a coach like Coach Williams and Bill Self help us tune out the noise. Truly, at Dimensional, that's the case. We all strive for success and delivering an outstanding investment experience to the end investor. And our ultimate goal is to help clients focus on the big picture. I have had some great people in my life that have really helped me, coached me throughout this journey. And there's no way I could have done this by myself. If I wanted to write my own life, I probably couldn't write it any better.